Hey guys, it's Give It To Gamer, and I am back here again, making guys a new video, and I hope you guys enjoy it. So, guess what, guys? Today, we're gonna to be playing. Actually, no, not playing. We're not playing the game. We are gonna be reacting to a trailer. Idiot. Anyways, today, we're gonna to be reacting to um, Vampire The Masquerade Bloodlines 2 um, gameplay trailer. Awesome. So, yeah, guys, um, if you guys don't know, there was actually a game called Vampire that came out a couple years ago, and it. Hmm, it's kind of like it was kind of like an open world uh, vampire game. You're essentially kind of like a. If I remember the story is because I've not played the game before, um, but I do want to go ahead and play it before I go ahead and you know play this one. Um, but yeah, essentially, if I remember the story is that you are a dude that is a doctor, but at the same time you're a vampire, and you basically go ahead and. Uh, Essentially, choose which people you want to kill. I guess. I guess that's how. I don't. I don't remember. Uh, it's been a couple of years since I've seen anything about that game. But since we have a new one coming out, because it looks like people actually really like the first one, you know, I go ahead and get uh, check it out and get the game. Uh, but yeah, so this is really cool. We get uh, Vampire uh, Bloodlines Two. And uh, yeah, let's see how the gameplay is, and let's see how it is. So I'm at, I'm I'm actually excited. I'm kind of excited because you know we've seen like a bunch of stuff in games. We've seen you know, but with zomb uh, the zombies, devils, uh, ghosts, spirits, all that stuff. But you know, sometimes uh, vampires are kind of like left out, and we've not seen that much uh, vampire games. Um, yeah, we have not seen that much about vampire games. So this is cool. So we have another one, which is uh, Vampire 2. So I'm actually excited. But anyways, guys, let's not waste any more time. Let's go ahead and uh, watch this trailer. Let's see how the gameplay is. Because remember on the first one, to be the one to tell you. is a third person game. And it looks like this one right here is going to be a first person. So it's going to be a little bit different how the first one was. But yeah, it's kind of cool. I'm excited. Oh, shit. You're dead. Ouch. The city. city. We're all fighting over scraps here. Ooh, look at the city. I've seen it raised by fire, shaken by quakes. Whatever you do in my city, I will hear about it. Seattle is firmly under my control. You're obviously new to this whole existence. But truth is, most of you types won't even make it a whole year. So you probably figured out that you need to drink blood. No. Oh. You can't just do whatever you want. Cities are carved up by political factions. Never tell anyone about what you are. See, vampires are extremely territorial. Unwittingly poaching someone's territory and suddenly whip. Damn. We have one rule. You don't break the masquerade. <laughs> Feed your power. Own the night. Oh shit, he's gonna attack my bats. Um, welcome to the first day of the rest of your death. Having fun yet? Got a message. Making that eyes. I'm happy to see you accepted my invitation. All I need you to do is to find a thin blood by the name of Slug. He's in hiding. But the Nosferatu most likely know where he is. Once you find Slug, all you have to do is purchase some information off of him. Feel free to use whatever methods are needed to get him to comply. Ouch. I assume your handlers have sent you to find our smelly friend. You can find Slug under the freeway, or in a place the locals call the jungle. He's smart enough to hide among the homeless down there, but not quite smart enough to do it well. Talk to him about coming to see us, and no one needs to know. We'll let you keep anything you've been promised from whoever sent you to me. But you'll want to watch yourself. Lots of unsavory animals in the jungle. I don't know you. That's a good start. 
Oh shit! Fine action. Coward, but he survived this long on his own, so he's bound to be a handful. One way. Damn. Oh he shit! You have a shotgun so equipped. Huh. The only one you'll need to look out for. Dude, this kind of reminds me of zombie in like the gameplay. Because how he picked up the shotgun and he had the bat. Yeah, it does remind me of zombies a little bit. Except this is like vampires. You're not fighting zombies. Oh no! Just let me go. He's been caught. Just let me leave. I can't do that. Bye bye. Yes or no? Twenty twenty. Damn. Vampire 2. Masquerade Bloodlines. Okay. That's awesome. Not bad, dude. The trailer looked really nice. You saw see some gameplay. The graphic looks really good, dude, and the story on that, I th I, it looks like you're kind of like a new uh, person that got into the Masquerade. So it's, it's a little bit more different how the first one was. I mean, on the first one, you were essentially a doctor guy, and now this one right here, you're actually a newcomer that's like part of the group, which is called, I guess, the Masquerade. And instead of it being on, in third person, like how the last one was, this right here is actually uh, first person. So it changes things up a little bit. But that's really cool. I kind of like that. Um, so that kind of makes me excited. The game comes out in 2020. So we still have a year in order for this game to come out. Which gives me enough time to go ahead and play the first one. So that way I'll be able to go ahead and and get to know the game a little bit more. Because essentially sometimes when it comes to these games. When it comes to a part 1, part 2, part 3. They essentially take uh, they continue on the story or what some stuff. But I don't know if the first one is going to be connected to this one. It might, it might not. I don't know. But I want to go ahead and play the first one and see how that is. And if anything in in the in number 2 one is referenced from number 1. Then I'll probably know what the heck is going on. So yeah. Uh, but anyways guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys are excited for this new vampire game. The Masquerade Bloodlines 2. I'm excited. Which means I want to go ahead and play the first one. And after that's all good. I want to go ahead and pick up this one up. So yeah. And so yeah. Really, really cool. But anyways guys. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Stay cool guys. Bye.